Now for, um, we've heard from some seniors who are eligible for the vaccine in this phase one, but have concerns that the vaccines have been developed too quickly and that perhaps it's not safe yet. What kind of advice would you give to folks with that concern? Sure. So way back in January, when uh, the virus was discovered, its genetic sequence was posted online and scientists all over the world had access to that and could hit the ground running to start the scientific and medical trials. This is different from using a live virus. That takes time to develop in the laboratory, it takes time to develop all those processes. So the scientists were able to hit the ground running because we knew the genetic sequence posted online. There was no compromise in the safety assessment or the effectiveness assessment in the trials. Uh, this was just a, a, an innovation uh, to use this, this technology to develop the vaccine. And it is quite something that we're able to do this. But it's important to know that literally tens of thousands of individuals received the either the Moderna or the Pfizer vaccine as part of those clinical trials. And those clinical trials um, evaluate both safety and effectiveness. The conclusions from both of those large trials was that both of these vaccines are safe and effective.